This is Angelina Jordan singing Bohemian Rhapsody for or to Grandma Mary, September 11th, 2022. And let's listen to this probably masterpiece. Mama. Sometimes I wish I'd never been born at all Oh, baby, can't do this to me, baby Just gotta get out, just gotta get out of me things first uh, like Grandma Mary I couldn't get through that one uh, no way especially Bohemian Rhapsody so here we are Angelina and Grandma Mary walking through a parking garage <laughs> acapella no music and uh, my god Whew. That's so beautiful. You know, it's, it's, the song is beautiful. Angelina is beautiful. Grandma's beautiful. The combination of Grandma and Angelina is beautiful. And you can see the love there is immense. And I think, you know, most grandparents love, love their grandchildren. I get it, you know. Um, but they got a special thing going on. I think... I. I believe personally it has to do with the artist connection. You know, Grandma Mary's an artist, a really good one. And, um, you know, she has her own style like any great artist has. You know, they're, they're identifiable by their style. Uh, you can tell them from a distance even that it's whose who's it is, right? And um, I guess t style and technique, I don't know. I'm not, an, I'm not a, you know, I don't know that much about that kind of stuff. But I just know that, you know, you, you, Typically, like with a, uh, somebody that sings, I mean, you, you hear their voice on a song you don't even recognize. You can say, yeah, I know who that is, but I don't recognize the song, right? So you can tell the singer, but not the necessarily uh, you hadn't heard them in that context before. So you don't have that as a relate. Now, in this case, we're in a parking garage, okay? <laughs> you know? uh, maybe the acoustics are good in parking garages. I don't really know. To me, they're kind of echoey, but uh, maybe that's a good thing. To me, that's like a reverb, right? So... Uh, they're walking through their parking garage. <laughs> Obviously, I don't know how tall uh, Grandma Mary is, but uh, Angelina is taller than Grandma Mary <laughs> by a lot. Okay, and um, you know that's that's fine. There's nothing wrong with that. It's just uh, striking uh, how much taller Angelina is, and uh, and uh, of course Grandma Mary is just uh, uh, enthralled by her granddaughter. And as well, she should be. And I think at some point, because of the art, artist uh, nature of Grandma Mary, that she saw in Angelina that spark, that uh, that that ability, that uh, curiosity uh, about music, and, and then how to make it her own and make it better every time, and have an intense interest and in always trying to uh, do a better version of whatever she. I mean, she improves her own version. You know, you hear a song like Bohemian Rhapsody at uh, uh, America's Got Talent. Since then, she's sang it in some live events and now here on this TikTok. And every time, I believe, every time she makes it just a little bit different and a little bit better in, a, in some way. And that's the nature of a genius, I think. They, they're never completely satisfied with the result. They can be happy with it. It's functional. It does what it's supposed to do, et cetera, et cetera. But, you know, like with a song, you know, you sing it, there's, people are touched and they're moved and it's beautiful. There were no technical errors or any errors of any kind you know so it's pretty you know it's a it's a nice piece of work 
um, possibly a masterpiece. But then what do you do? What's the next thing? You know, next time you do it, you can't do a copy. You could. Some people do that. Actually, most people do that. But, you know, you uh, for the genius, they have to figure out a different way to tune that in just a little bit better. And that's my, this is just my belief, my, you know, my understanding, a limited understanding of these kinds of things. And uh, there it is, right there in front of you. Walking through a parking garage, filming yourself on your cell phone. <laughs> no professional filming equipment. Um, and with your grandma, and they're hugging each other, and uh, the love is obvious, and yet she's able to uh, sing that song beautifully beautifully and if she sang it for a grandma for some reason it doesn't really say if there was a reason you don't need a reason to sing for your grandma okay you don't need a reason if you're angelina you don't need a reason to sing period just sing and uh you know look look at look at that you know that's just the whole the whole thing is just beautiful it really is the love the fam the family love the, the song, the, you know, the setting as, uh, we'll call it, as unproduction-like as uh, possible. And look at the quality. That's what, you know, people that don't know Angelina and aren't necessarily fans of Angelina, I don't know if they really understand what they have here. I really don't. Because when you see these things like this, this uh, these, you know, maybe, I think that's probably got a lot of views on it. I don't even know. Uh, the TikTok video. Yeah, I don't know. It doesn't really say. But um, uh, it, it's incredible. It's incredible. A lot of people can sing. A lot of people need help singing. They need electronic, you know, uh, modification, if you will. Or they need, a, they need background music or they need this or that. And there's some people that sing pretty well a cappella, too. The thing is that Angelina just touches my heart. I don't, hey like it or leave it. I mean, it's the way it is, right? And uh, I think a lot of, it seems like she strikes this chord with the older dudes uh, more so than, uh, and maybe just an old, the older generation, but it seems like a lot of men are, uh, like myself, are captivated because we've lived a long time, seen a lot of things, done a lot of things, heard a lot of things, and we've never heard nothing like this. And that seems to be the general consensus. So is there something to that? I would think so. But what is it? Hard to put into words. Almost impossible. You just know. So I will stop my ramblings as I have to force myself to do at times because I can sit here and talk about Angelina until I fall asleep and you guys watch me snoring on the screen. But I am actually, let me see, I am, ooh, I'm officially five hours and ten minutes late for work. <laughs> It ain't funny. But today's rainy and cold and nasty, and I work at a marina, and there's not going to be too many customers today, like zero. So I don't think it's – there's other people there, and I don't think it's – I'm not uh, – there's nothing pressing that I have to do. But I am going to go in and do some things that I can do and will do and get those done and taken care of. So let us depart, my friends, my brothers, my sisters – my Angelina Angels, my fellow Angelina Angels, and we'll see you on the next video. Okay, bye-bye.